Come on, you Reds! The Fans for Diversity campaign is run by the Football Supporters Federation and Kick It Out, promoting diversity and inclusion and bringing together a broad range of football fans to create a positive and comfortable environment watching their team. We talk to fans from Crawley Town's Disabled Supporters Association to find out what football really means to them. I love Crawley Town uh, so much. I would do anything for it. I really, really would. I'm coming out doing something I love. I'm passionate about football, but Crawley Town, I love them. I think they're brilliant. I first came to watch Crawley in 1953 when I was five. So I got hit by a car and lost most uh, my leg, right leg just above the knee. It was, it was taken off. 90 minutes, you're out there kicking every ball, <laughs> even kicking some of the players. <laughs> but the disabled setup here is second to none, you know. I love Crawley Town Football Club. And if I can't go to away games there, I'm listening on Reds player. Yeah, I have to say, it is a big part of my life. The Disabled Association, for me, has been a really important move. We didn't set up because we had to sort of fight for anything. We were actually uh, invited to put a shopping list of things together that we thought would improve the club. The people up there in the uh, disabled section and around have been coming for all the, by the last 10, 12 years that I've been coming here and they, um, it's like a little club, you know, we're, uh, we all get there, have a chat before the game, have a moan at half time, <laughs> if it's not going well. It's brilliant, the people, the staff, the fans, watch the game afterwards, go home happy. If we lose, we're sad, <laughs> but we're all right. At Kick It Out, we tackle discrimination whilst promoting inclusion. We empower football fans, helping them to raise awareness of the importance of diversity and inclusion in the game. The concept of football being a sport that welcomes all is a big part of our work. I felt discriminated when we went to this uh, team in Kent where they uh, <laughs> made us park three quarters of a mile away and then you had to sort of struggle and walk, you know, that distance. I feel, I feel angry when that happens because it shouldn't happen. How would you feel, you know, if, you, if the roles were reversed? How would you feel if you had to put up with that, you know? You just need people to be aware of you, help you out when you need it. For not to be angry or cross at it, but just to understand that I wish I could do the things that I used to be able to do, but I can't. I, always get and I just need a bit of help. You know that. It is really important to just treat disabled people just as normal people. You know, we are. <laughs> you know, we might not be able to walk or see or hear properly or whatever, you know, but apart from that, you operate as an individual just like anybody else. And I think the beauty of it is in football, if you're a disabled supporter, you get to know all those mates around you and nobody thinks about the fact you're disabled. You're just all there yelling your team on. You're all in it together. And, and that's a good feeling. For more information on Fans for Diversity, visit kickitout.org.